What's up, Days Tattoo Nation? Chris, the Dace Man Dace here, bringing you yet another game review for the Dace Man Show YouTube channel. Today we'll be talking about Death Squared and a little description from their website. Uh, it is a cooperative puzzle game for one to two or four players. Best enjoyed with loved ones who don't mind a little arguing for the greater good. Prove your teamwork skills in Death Squared as you solve puzzles together or die trying. Each player needs to guide a robot to a colored coded goal, but the path is beset with deadly traps and hazards. Teams of players will need to closely observe and communicate to keep each other alive and discover a solution together. Teamwork is the answer. Complete the main campaign in single player or with two players, then take a group into four player party mode for the ultimate teamwork trial. Those that can't get enough, head to the vault to find extra experiments recommended only for the brave. The history of this is the original, uh, original prototype originated in 2015 at a 48-hour global game jam themed What Do We Do Next? Some of the features are it's a perfect puzzle gateway game for you to play with a non-gamer partner, i.e. Chris Dace, who is a terrible non-gamer. Uh, it's a one- to two-player teamwork story mode with 80 challenging levels, two- to four-party uh, chaos family mode with 40 insane levels, 10-plus hours of puzzling co-op gameplay, which includes 30 vault, two- and four-player levels for those who want an even bigger challenge. Uh, deemed too hard for the main game, with more coming post-launch for, you got it, free. The uh, game was released March 4th, will be released March 14th. See that? Because Chris is an idiot. Uh, it's going to be released March 14th, and it's made by SMG Studio. You can get it on the PlayStation 4, Xbox One, or Steam, Windows, or Mac. Their website is deathsquared.com, and it'll be going for the price of $19.99 American dollars. American dollars. The game itself has great commentary that goes on in the background as you're playing, which reminds you a little bit of the Portal game, where it's testing your knowledge with the robots and, you know, solving these puzzles. The interaction between the programmer and the robot or AI is phenomenal to hear that going on and if you take too long to do the puzzle they're going to let you know you took too long to do the puzzle again this co-op game it will be available March 14th on PS4, Xbox One and Steam and you guys can have lots of fun for hours and hours and of course piss off your friends by not cooperating properly thank you for tuning in to this game review I recommend to go get it I give it a 9 out of 10 because it's so much fun even though I played with myself, like most nights. Uh, check out everything going on at thedacemanshow.com. Uh, like us on facebook.com slash show. Give us a little subscribe here on youtube.com slash show. Heart us over on twitch.tv slash friends. Uh, follow us on Twitter at show. Follow me personally on Twitter at thedaceman. And again, if you missed all that, go to thedacemanshow.com where everything is available. And I mean everything everything. So for the few, for the proud, and for the day's tacular, remember my friends, keep gaming because, well quite frankly, gaming is life.